What's up? Oh. Oh, did, was it? Yeah. All right. So, they, I've heard it expressed. The highest admiration that can be given to you from another is to mimic what you do. Well, I guess I could be flattered except for they did such a piss poor job. Like, you sent a constant contact that the links didn't work. That's, a, that's the only reason I got interested was like, none of the links were, what the hell is this? Well, that and some of my customers went, hey dude, um, I think they copied your site. I said, let me see this. So, if you've been getting emails from sarms.4retards or something like that, um, dot, there is no dot com, it's just sarms.4retards, I think. This is what it looks like if you actually can open it because, whew, all right, now this, you see, here, let me see if I can help you out here. Right here, you see that? That, my friends, is the proper neuroid site. You have this big long, um, hey, research chemicals are not for human consumption. They're only for your fish, frog, monkey, mouse, and spider cricket, like a lot of puss. And then you have this, hey, subscribe to our thing, right? Well, over here, you get this little spinny wheel pop-up thing that looks kind of like somebody else's. But anyway, and it, you notice, I understand there are templates that can be used, right? Using a template's one thing, but uh, <laughs> research ready chemicals, you see this little right here? Yeah, if you look over here, oh wait, let's go back, oh sorry, let's start from the top. Research ready chemical, what? And, uh, <laughs> and I went, nah, nah, it's really not. Like, so then we come back over here and you keep scrolling, latest products, Latest, per and then I went, wait a minute, surely, surely they didn't. Wait, oh, they got bundles for like, yeah. Mm -hmm. What are research chemicals? What are research It's almost like some jackass mimicked the site. Almost exactly, except for he just changed the little thing to liquids. Then I got it. I went, hmm. Well, let's see. I know that new Tricare, my old web guy, well, he kind of took that one because legally, guys, <clears throat> according to the law, in order for me to get him for stealing, well, I have to prove that the site's mine and that I don't owe him money. And how do you prove you don't owe a web guy money who can just print receipts for whatever fucking reason they want? Especially, see, I can show that he's actually stole upwards of $56,000 from us. But if I take that to court, then it just means I have to pay a federal lawyer, which I've already done once with one case, and that was like $10,000 retainer fee. And then... If the person's broke, can't get no money from a broke muffin. So that leaves me with damn near no recourse. I can't throw him in jail for this unless he charges a card. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to patiently wait. I've made orders on new Tricare. I've tried to get him to charge. I'm like, please, bitch. But I don't have anything to go on there. If you order from New Tricare and they charge you ten cents, one cent, if they neg if they give you a penny, let me know because then we have a lawsuit. But I really don't. Till then, I just there's no recourse. So he did create the site per se. Actually, that's a long story. He we'll get into the whole story and everyone behind it later but this is what you need to know 
SARMs dot for sale. That will be the last time I ever say that. Is not my site. I think I know whose it is, but he's an asshole. So most likely you're not gonna get real shit. And it mimics somebody else's product almost to a team. He's a fun size guy. We'll get into that later too. But as of right now, y'all, honestly, um, there's nothing I can do about that. Now this. This, I've got the lawyers on. Because not only did he mimic the site, but I'm pretty sure that, excuse me, there's somebody calling as I'm videoing. Um, I'm pretty sure that he fraudulently has tried to get you, since so many of you have he may just be really good at marketing, but I think he kind of got the emails that have um, went to New Tricare and has emailed a list. I don't know how to prove it yet, but we're working on it, buddy. Honestly. What a douche. Like, what kind of shitty ass move is that? You know, I mean, God's honest truth. Like, <laughs> oh. So. These liquids are probably, well, if the guy will rip my side off, I got money that says he will uh, bullshit you on product as well. Now, if you want to hear the full story and how deep the bullshit goes and you want me to call out some names, that will be the next video. But right now, I just want to let y'all know. Um, I'll tell you what. Matter of fact, right now, I got, I will do a promo code for 30% off anything on the site. Um, promo code. <laughs> SARMS. The number four. Your SARMS number four. Because I don't even want to give them any more credit than is due. So this fucktard right here, whoever it is, I think we're going to go through and do some investigative reporting next. I'll get me a cigar and we'll sit down and we will do the investigative reporter, Mr. Williams goes through and finds douchebag and um, outs his ass on YouTube because they have earned a little bit more than my contempt at this point and should be yours as well because they're trying to sell you some more bullshit like you haven't been through that enough. So I think it's time we out him and his company as well. So let's have some fun guys. I'll see you on the next video.